Have you ever wondered how grocery stores monetize their data? That's right. The grocery store is not just about fresh produce and pantry staples. It's a data powerhouse, quietly collecting valuable information with every transaction. Welcome to the fascinating world of data monetization in grocery retail. This is the practice of using data to generate revenue, an increasingly vital aspect of the modern retail landscape. In a world where data is the new oil, grocery stores are sitting on a potential gold mine. Every item scanned at the checkout, every loyalty card swipe, every online order, these all create a rich tapestry of data that can be analyzed and leveraged for additional income. It's not just about selling groceries, it's about understanding customer behavior, optimizing operations, and ultimately, increasing profits. So, how do grocery stores transform heaps of data into a gold mine? Stay tuned to find out. The first step in data monetization is gathering data. Imagine grocery stores as vast gold mines of data. They use a variety of tools to dig up this valuable resource. One of these tools is the ubiquitous loyalty card. Each swipe of the card provides a wealth of information, such as the shopper's buying habits and personal preferences. Online shopping is another treasure trove. Each click, each item added to the virtual cart, and each purchase made provides data about customer behavior. And then there's in-store tracking, which observes how customers move through the store, what catches their eye, and what items they pick up or leave behind. The types of data collected are varied, from simple demographic information like age and gender, to more complex data like shopping habits and purchase histories. This data forms a detailed picture of the customer, their preferences, their habits, and their needs. Once the data is collected, it's time to analyze and make sense of it. After gathering data, grocery stores analyze it to extract meaningful insights. Now imagine a gold miner who's just collected a bunch of raw gold. He's got the gold, sure, but it's in its raw form. To truly unlock its value, he needs to refine it, mold it, and shape it into something useful. That's exactly what analysis is in data monetization. Today's data analytics tools are like the miner's refinement tools. They sift through vast amounts of raw data to unearth priceless insights about customer behavior. These tools help identify trends, such as what products are popular during which seasons or at what time of day. They can even predict future buying patterns helping stores to anticipate demand. These insights are the refined gold. They allow grocery stores to make strategic decisions about product placement and pricing to maximize profits and ensure customer satisfaction. With these valuable insights in hand, the next step is to put them to good use. Now, it's time to make the data work for the grocery store. You've gathered it, analyzed it, and now it's about translating those insights into action. This is where the magic happens. Insights from data can be used to enhance the customer experience by planning relevant assortments. For instance, by understanding shopping patterns, a store can rearrange its layout to make popular items easier to find. This not only improves the shopping experience, but can also lead to increased sales. Speaking of sales, data can also help optimize them. By analyzing purchase trends and inventory, stores can ensure they're stocking the right products at the right time, reducing waste and maximizing profit. Operations too can be streamlined. Data can reveal inefficiencies in processes, helping to cut costs and increase efficiency. And yes, data can be monetized directly by selling it to third parties like suppliers. This allows for targeted advertising, benefiting both the store and the supplier. Clearly, data monetization isn't just about selling data, it's about using it to create a competitive advantage. So, we've seen that data monetization is a multi-step process that involves gathering, analyzing, and utilizing data. It starts with the collection of seemingly mundane details, things like customer purchases, shopping habits, and even the time spent in store. But, when carefully analyzed, these details morph into valuable insights that can be leveraged to boost sales, optimize store layout, and personalize marketing efforts. Data monetization is not just about making money from data, but rather about using that data to make more informed business decisions. It's about turning numbers into action, 
into strategies that can outmaneuver competition, attract new customers, and retain existing ones. In the cutthroat world of retail, data monetization is a game changer. It's a tool that can transform grocery stores from mere suppliers of goods into customer-centric, profit-maximizing businesses. Remember, in the world of retail, data isn't just numbers. It's a valuable asset that can be monetized to drive growth and profitability.